Greetings. I'm Tori Washington, Assistant Principal with Dallas Independent School District. I'm currently serving as Assistant Principal with Joseph J. Rhodes Early Learning Center for the fall of 2020-2021 school year. According to our district demographics, the number of campuses, uh, Dallas Independent School District is one of the fastest growing and improving school districts, according to the Council of the Great City of Schools. We employ 22,222 staff members to serve a diverse population of 153,861 students in 230 schools. We're also keeping pace with Dallas families' desires for more educational choices as evidenced by significant expansion of pre-kindergarten classrooms. We have 152-way dual language programs and 27 PTIC programs in collegiate academies. Our ethnic makeup is predominantly Hispanic. Um, we have a large um, percentage of Hispanic students at right at 70.2%. We have a 21.8% uh, African American, 0.3% Native American, and 1.3% Asian or Pacific Islander, 5% White, and 1% uh, that were that was not um, that was not um, identified. Okay. Um, the academics of concern for the district are we have this year the African American Success Student Initiative from the district, and also increasing kindergarten readiness. So right now, they're the student cultural or social issue of concern. Um, our board declared recently Black Lives Matter, and so we've been doing a lot of uh, cultural awareness trainings and um, a team building around that, being culturally sensitive and aware. For the purpose of the, this activity, um, I was to get with a business or finance manager um, to interview them, um, getting to gain some knowledge of the financial practices uh, and protocol and regulations that govern uh, the business and finance office of a school district. I was able to talk to our deputy chief of finance and he was very, very helpful as you will see it in the video. And the meeting was scheduled at 3 p.m., scheduled to run about um, 30 minutes. And during my observations, I did record notes and uh, kept my video. And so and to analyze the information that I will receive, I'll just re, uh, look at the video again. I'll be thinking about the order, length of time, um, looking at the questions again in hopes that um, I'll get a clear understanding of those large finance terms. Um, I hope you enjoy the video. I'll see you at the conclusion. Thank you.